Hi, I am so excited that you got your goodies and I am excited to show you how to build your palette. So I'm going to show you how I do it. There really is no wrong or right way to do it. I, I do have a system for me that I feel works for me. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. As you can see, I need to um, replace this palette. So this is the mini double decker. This is the one you girls um, probably have now. I had to continue. I had to move on to my triple decker because I like to fit a lot of my stuff in one place. So I have a lot of my eyeshadows here and I'll show you this at the end. But in the meantime, let me explain to you here how I have my mini decker. Uh, it's a very good way to have it. I go in the order of the colors that I have. So my first color here, as you can see, is the darkest color. That is your contour. Some of you girls might have indigo, which is this one. Some of you might have Astoria. And depending on your skin tone, you might have something like olive or, um, oh, henna is also a very popular one. But most of you girls like the deeper contour, so you might have one that looks really dark. Um, and I'm just sharing with you that I love, love, love to use indigo and Astoria. So that's my first color because that's the one that I apply first. So this is the color that you go in with your brush and you apply to the hollows of your cheek, the top of your forehead by your hairline, and then you can chisel out your um, jawline with this color. And you can also contour your nose uh, and you can watch one of my videos or I can help you if you need more help on that. The next color you see here is a very, very light, light color. This is not the color of my skin. This is the one that I use to brighten my eyes up. So this one, I like to use my Buffy brush and I like to add this in these areas as a concealer. And I use that because I do have dark circles and I do look tired most of the time, even when I'm very well rested. So you can see that when I add that to these areas, it makes a big difference. That's my second color. I also add that between my eyebrows, down the bridge of my nose a little bit, and down my cupid's bow and my chin, making kind of like an invisible triangle of brightness because that's where people look at us um, when they talk to us. So that's my second color. My third color is the closest color to my skin, what we are usually um, considering our foundation, even though our foundation is made up of these three. But for explanation purposes, the color that looks closer to your skin, mine is goddess, that's my third color. So I put that wherever I don't have these two colors. That's how I get that one layer makeup. So some of you, well, <clears throat> there's different colors depending on your skin tone. Some of you could be mango, some of you can be amber, some of you can be papaya. Whatever the color is that's closest to your skin, that's my third color. This color over here is my Bella Bronzer, which is a must have for me. Um, even though I put that last, um, after my lip and cheek, I kind of just have it in this order. So again, my contour, my high, my concealer, my main color, and my Bella bronzer. Those are my four main colors for my face. On the bottom here, you're going to see that I have my illuminator. This is Dolce. We add this one to just the areas that we want to illuminate for a little glow. I even add that to the tip of my nose sometimes, and it gives me like a cute little button nose. So I can show you more about that if you have questions later. And then here I usually keep my favorite lip and cheek. At the moment, I have Cindy. I love this color. So this is the first layer. So I can literally just walk out of the house and only use this layer and be completely done. Okay, so there goes my first layer. My second layer, I just have extra things. Um, I have an extra lip and cheek, actually two of them because I do get bored of the same one and I like to change them up all often. I have my perfume. If you guys haven't tried the perfume, it is delicious and it's adorable that it just fits right in your palette. Um, this is the color linen. This is very optional. I like to brighten up my eyes. What I do with linen, and maybe you can see, it's very pigmented. And I usually just stick that in the corner of my eyes like that. You see that? And then I blend it in to just give me an extra brightening. I do not give this to many people unless you ask for it because it is very optional and it might not be necessary for you if you don't really feel like you need that. I just think it looks super cute to have those corner of my eyes pop. So that's the color linen. And then I have some eyeshadows. I, I also get bored of the same eyeshadows. I like to change them up. 
um, which is why I enjoy my triple decker, which I will show you later. But here I get to fit four. If you only want to have one lip and cheek, you get to add a few more of eyeshadows on there. So this is the color that I also use for my eyebrows. Um, this is, and then the, these are just a mix of fall colors that I've been using this week. I'm sorry about my palette. I use it a lot. It's dirty. I need to get a new one. But girls, this is pretty much it. Your mini double decker. Now I have the triple decker and it's not full right now because I have my stuff in here. But if you can see, you will get to fit a lot of things in this double decker. I get to, I mean the triple decker. I get to put everything that's in here because I get to fit one, two, three, four. There's, I think I fit six nine big tins okay i keep all my lip and cheeks here because i do like to have many of them here I'm, i feel a little bit restricted i do love this one if i have a small purse when i change my purses you know just for fun but this is my go-to this is where i use every day i have my vanilla dust which is my setting powder that i like to add in areas that i am um oily so this one you would use and just kind of dab so that it collects the oils throughout the day if you need it and in this one i even have my lip conditioner it's a little dirty for my lipstick this is like the cutest chapstick so i also got this one from mascara and then if i didn't have this in here i would have my perfume in here and other illuminators and then on my third layer is where i get to have some more fun with my shadows it gives me just more space um to, to play around with different shadows different days and i even get to add my um other illuminator which is a powder one which is very pretty i like to change it up so a lot of you girls have actually ordered this one this week because i think the triple decker came back in it's about 27 dollars. i want to say maybe that's the double decker i would have to check but hopefully that this one helped if you do have the mini decker the mini double decker it is really convenient hopefully you love this makeup so much that you have to upgrade to a bigger palette and then you can just save this for um different occasions when you want something smaller but you will not regret getting this one because here you get to fit your four colors for your highlight your bella bronzer multiple lip and cheeks multiple eyeshadows your perfume your lip conditioner your setting powder and so much more so if you're interested in this one please feel free to grab the link from my um, instagram or my facebook or reach out to me and i will send you the link directly uh they have a really cute um, new pattern that I'm probably going to order this week because I'm super excited about that. So I hope that this helped you. Thank you so much girls for trusting me and for reaching out to me to color match you. And I can just pray that you love the makeup and that you continue to come back for some more girls. I would love if you can share my video, um, and recommend your friends. And also remember that I am helping, um, by doing virtual Facebook parties or in-house Facebook part, not Facebook. If they're in house, they're at your house. If you prefer to have them on Facebook, it's an awesome way to get free makeup and um, accumulate points to shop for free. So let me know if you're interested in that. Thank you so much. And please, you have my phone number. Call me with anything that you need. Thank you, girls.